ready. What up? Let's get to it. So we talked about it, how the Vikings have good coaches on the staff, how teams will come after them. What choices will the Vikings make? Will the coaches make? Will they stay, go, etc.? Some have stayed, but some are leaving as well. So yes, news in, two more Vikings coaches, assistants, are on their way out the door. One, I think, who was just let go because of Brian Flores, the new people he will be bringing in. And the other one hired by the Denver Broncos. Heavy. It's what it is, man. Teams are going to come after good coaches. That's the business. You want to see people stay right, stay around, finish the job, finish the challenge right, finish what you started heavy. Like, make history for real. But, yes, I'm sure. But, yes, it is about the money, moving up, exposure, etc. It's part of the business, huh? But sometimes you want to see guys just, yeah, stay loyal to a team, rock with a team. Understand it's a business. But, man, <laughs> stick around. <laughs> Come on, man. That's what it's about. Chemistry vibes, good energy. Dig me heavy. But let's get to it, man. So Ben Kotwika. Hope I said his name right once again. Ben Kotwika. Primary assistant to Matt Daniels. Special teams assistant. Basically, Matt Daniels' right-hand man. Was hired by the Denver Broncos to be their special teams coordinator. It is what it is. That's how it goes. That's how the cookie crumbles sometimes, right? Nothing you can do about it. But the Vikings, part of the business, part of the process, part of the off-season program, right? Coaches leave. You find new coaches, just like with players, right? If you happen to lose talent, go acquire some more. Heavy. So good coaches will get opportunities, and we're seeing it now. Vikings just got to bounce back, and I'm sure Brian Flores knows guys he can bring in. That's where collaboration will be key, very important. Communicate, communication, man. No egos ever, heavy. Greg Minuski, linebacker's coach for the Vikings. They're basically parting ways, right? Like I said earlier, Brian Flores being hired, he's going to bring his own personnel in, going to bring in his own coaches, guys he wants to rock with, he trusts, etc. So it is what it is. That's the bottom line. Situations like those happen as well, where a guy just has to go because it's a new coach coming in. He wants who he wants, rocks with who he rocks with, trusts who he trusts, and there's nothing wrong with that. And Greg Nunsky, he'll be able to find work, find another job, even though the linebacker play wasn't very great. <laughs> it wasn't phenomenal last season. Now, I know it was players who were aging out, etc., but even then, Linebacker play was pretty bad, man. So it is what it is. I'm sure Brian Flores got a guy he's about to bring in. That's how the business works, right? Heavy. But yeah, man, that's my take, my opinion on it. Wish both of those coaches the best until they come across the Vikings. <laughs> you know what it is. Big skull head. Skull Vikes. Skull forever. How you feel about it, man? About coaches leaving, staying, etc. Feel like they should stay, build something? You dig me? Stay loyal to a team for a while? Heavy? Finish the challenge? Or you think they should go to a better, more higher paying opportunity? What it's about? Let's get to it, man. Big skull head. Who me? Who me? I ain't got no picture, hit me? Skull like that. Heavy.